it's Miss Kyra. I am so happy to see you all out there. Before I tell you our story, let's sing our hello song. Are you ready? You can stand up if you like. <laughs> One, two, three. Hello, hello. singing our hello song <laughs> now the story that I have in store for you it's called Anemone finds adventure and you know what it is an incredible story after the story we're gonna do a little bit of talking about Anemone finds adventure but in the meantime Go sit down, relax, get a cover, go sit on the couch, oh, or go into your room, grab a friend or a family member, and let's read our story about Anim Oni Finds Adventure. <laughs> Anim Oni Finds Adventure, written by Matthew Griffins. Anim Oni lived in the ocean. All day long, she clung to the same slippery rock with her single big foot. Her tiny tentacles caught tasty treats. On days when she felt cross, her stinking tentacles kept the other creatures away. But today, her rock felt lonely. I have no fins. I have no feet. I am different to every other creature. Even that hermit crab is off having adventures. Save me! That fish wants to pluck me out of my shell. And Nim Oni whips up her stinging tentacles and hit the hermit underneath them. Go away, you big bully. The big fish bared his teeth, but was afraid of being stung. He gave up and swam away with a cheeky flick of his tail. <sighs> that was close, said the crab. Is it safe now? You can come out, crab. What's your name? Herman. I'm a hermit, but I think I need a bodyguard. I wish I was as brave as you. I'm Ann Nim Oni. I wish I had amazing adventures like you. But why don't you? He asked. I'm stuck to my rock and I don't have legs, she replied. Well, I don't have stings, but I do have an idea. Herman took Anim Oni by the tentacles and danced around her, pulling silly faces. First, Anim Oni snorted, and then she giggled, and then she laughed so hard she popped right off her rock. Herman gently picked her up and settled her on his shell. Are you ready? I feel an adventure coming on, he said. And Nimoni adventures all over the ocean, catching tasty treats. Now she only uses her stinging tentacles to keep the nasty fish away from Herman. And she never, ever feels lonely. And Nim Oni finds adventure. The end. <gasps> oh my gosh! And Nim Oni found a friend. His name is Herman. I think they were perfect for each other. And then Monique, she helped Herman to stand up for himself. She protected him. And Herman helped Anne and 
to find adventure, to go around in the ocean looking for new and exciting things. It really helped Anna Monique not be in her comfort zone. Now, beautiful butterflies, a comfort zone is when you want to just do the same thing every single day, all day. And you never really want to do anything else. Sometimes there's nothing wrong with that, but in order to grow and in order to find excitement in life, sometimes we have to do new and challenging things so we can better ourselves. I think that we should all try to be like Anne and Moni, finding nice and positive friends and being able to do nice and fun and adventurous things with each other. <laughs> I love that story. Oh, my favorite part is when they were singing and Herman twirled and Moni around and she popped off of her rock and he stuck her onto his shell <laughs> and then they went off to their adventure oh i just love that part they were perfect friends now beautiful butterflies until next time you take care and you be positive stay kind stay sweet and do something exciting go and talk to your parents about something exciting you can do or talk to a trusted adult that you can talk to and i want to hear all about your adventures and i'll see you all soon bye <laughs> you would like to see another episode of kyra's corner please subscribe and click like i can't wait to see you beautiful butterflies again remember be kind to each other and be kind to yourself bye